guys, it's me. Welcome to my channel. I am on my way to um, JFK Airport. I am heading over to the UK for a 10 day getaway to visit my family. And in the middle of that, we are um, going on excursions and traveling and all that stuff. This is the third time I actually rescheduled this trip only because um, with COVID and everything and the restrictions, I had to uh, reschedule. So, we're here. This video will show you that, you know, all the excursions that I've done, everything that, um, you know, experience the beauty of England, as well as reuniting with my family. I haven't seen them in over two years. It's been pre-pandemic before. Come join along and welcome to the party. Hey guys, I am at Jamaica train station. I am going to the air train to get to JFK. Stay tuned. Next, I will probably show it after I get through security check and I check in. So stay with me, stay tuned. Here we go. Pretty much what it is is that comparable to us knee workers it's kind of like a grand central terminal um or a penn station so essentially i had just taken the train from Heathrow airport and now i am waiting for my train to go to leeds um take i finally was able to take off my mask just get a breath of fresh air after i don't know like 12 to 14 hours, but taking that first breath of fresh air is just amazing. Being here, and actually it's like a 20, 20 degree difference compared to New York. New York was in the 70s here, it's like pushing low 50s. But I am going to give you a bird's eye view. As we can see here is the the rail station, this is where I'm gonna be entering on taking the train. And then that is where I had come out of. Beautiful church. I can't tell you guys, it's been one, one long freaking pandemic. So happy to be back. And this is only the beginning of my adventures. Um, Let's see what we got going on over here. So, let's walk around here. This is, looks like it is an intersection. Some sort. Oh, looks like I see a five guys straight ahead. Let me zoom in a little bit. There's the five guys. 
There's the Mickey D's. Huge intersect. Oh my god, another McDonald's? I feel like this is Long Island with 7-Elevens. Oh, the infamous Nando's. This is just unbelievable. I am just in awe. It's just, like I said, it's been one hell of a pandemic. The birds are chirping. The sun is shining. Apparently, during my stay, it's going to be a little wet. As my cousins would say, it's going to be pissing it down. But, you know, making the most of this, taking in the sun, loving the crisp weather, it's just a total shock because I had come here back in, you know, I've been here in the summertime before and it has been extremely humid out. <laughs> and let me tell you something, I sweat a freaking lot. And, you know, if you're like me and get hot really easily, this doesn't help. And the other thing, I mean, London has like places with air conditioners and stuff, but more so like anywhere outside of London, there isn't really a lot of air, <laughs> air conditioners. I mean, I've stayed at hotels right around the block from where my family lives and they, there's no AC in the hotel. So here I am with the window open, covers just, you know, covers off and sweating in the middle of the night, waking up in a pool of sweat. But to each their own, some people like that. But, wow, I, I, still, I still can't get older on here. Uh, flight was very smooth. We got here actually earlier than expected probably like half hour to 45 minutes prior for less tourists and travelers. So um, there wasn't really a TSA, I'm sorry, like a, like a check-in. I, I don't know what the word is, guys, help me. There wasn't really a check-in, more so it was just scanning my passport, so it was kind of like easy breezy and we were able to get through. Um, since I did fly premium class, um, my luggages were one of the first to come out, which is freaking amazing. Thank you, Virgin. And from there, oh, I mean, from there I took the, as my cousins would also say it, the tube, but I call it the tube because I'm so New York. Um, it's the underground, what they call it here, but um, took that and now I'm here. It's been one hell of a ride, and next steps are, this train ride is gonna be about a little over two hours. I'm gonna be going into Leeds train station. And then from there, um, I'm taking the train to uh, an area, a suburb of Leeds. I'm not gonna disclose uh, where my family lives. And then from there, I'm gonna be walking to their house. But, guys, I'm here. I came to the UK under the impression that there's not gonna be any fall things, no pumpkin, no apple, because you know, I, I would think that's a basic American thing, right? I go to Starbucks and they got a PSL. So this, this basic bitch is gonna be having PSLs throughout the whole trip. Hey guys, today is Monday, October 25th, 2021. Heading out to Harrogate, which is about an hour-ish or so up. Uh, we are going for afternoon tea today, so I will take more videos and take you around. It was really slow as we go around the corner. It's a nice day as well, just a good day. have been here for like an hour and a half or so. That's my cousin Morgan. 
we had stopped at the local pub with the spoons and we picked up some gin and tonic, sat out, relaxed. Right, Morgan? Yeah. So now we're just walking along the streets to local shops while uh, we're getting pretty close to our time at the tea room. So our reservations are at 2.30. So we're gonna do afternoon tea. There's gonna be scones, tea, finger sandwiches. Can't wait for the smoked salmon. That's a pro, that's a plus. And uh, looking forward to it. We're gonna be doing some walking around. Weather is actually quite nice. It's probably, I would say about 40 to 50 degrees Fahrenheit and it's cloudy out, but it's quite nice. I am going to show more videos of, you know, what we're walking around, the shops we're encountering here. So this is the street. Walking down, we just passed um, the fishmonger. And now we are walking past different stores and restaurants. Coming up, we actually had just walked past um, some of the bigger stores. Walking down the street, we passed some stores like um, Next, uh, H&M, Starbucks, all those lined up nice chain stores. This jacket was actually from Next. Actually quite grown fond of it. We are making a left here, and we're going down another line of different, different stores and, um, you know, kind of just killing time in the meantime. Once we're done with our uh, afternoon tea, we're gonna do some more tour, you know, more walking around, touring. You know, this is my third time here and I haven't, you know, I've never been to Harrogate. And back in 2018, I was with a bunch of tourists, um, well, expats, I was on an expat tour. And ultimately they were saying, you have to go to Harrogate because there's just so much beauty in this city. There is the Turkish baths, there are, you know, it's kind of high-end bougie like myself. There's a bunch of um, different type of, um, you know, the scenery is just different here. And yeah, everybody was just telling me about it. So I figured this was one of the things that I had to do while I'm here. And also, you know, what's England without an afternoon tea, am I right? Okay. Oh, come on. Okay. Sam, don't mind me doing filming no, tomorrow. No, I was there tomorrow. Why didn't they plan an individual video? Because I'm going to see so Yeah, I'm probably going to break th break these videos out in parts. So I'm probably going to do.
Oh no, I would probably do, instead of not, not like part one, part two, I would probably do like days, whatever came out. Day, whatever. I'm not gonna do like part one, part two. Yeah. Yeah. So we made it over to the <laughs> Target Tiku. 